All right, guys, uh, CrossFit Rigtown's home workout program today. Our warm up is going to consist of a one minute handstand hold. So you can do that free floating, you can do that up on a wall. Um, if you can't uh, do a handstand hold, what you can do is you can do an object hold overhead. So you can use a plate, just hold that up over your head, make sure that you're pressing through those lats, not your traps. Hold that up overhead. You can even use a dumbbell, just grabbing the heads of the dumbbells like so and then holding up over your head, all right? After that, we're gonna go into three rounds of 20 arm circles. So remember, we're gonna stay here. So you have 10 to the front, 10 to the back. Then you have three wall walks. So remember, we're starting off in a push-up plank position, walking yourself all the way up the wall, pointing those toes at the top, and then walking yourself down nice, slow, and control. Um, or you're gonna do an inchworm push-up. So again, remember, pushing those hips back, Walking yourself out here, making sure that you're in control. Push up and then walk yourself in. Um, you have six burpees, so remember, go down, touch your chest to the ground, give yourself a little bit of a hop, and then you have a 30 second plank hold on your elbows. Your Metcon today or your workout, you have a 20 minute AMRAP. So, again, remember, AMRAP stands for as many rounds and reps as possible in that 20 minute time domain. We have a 200 meter run, or roughly about six houses down away from you. Then you have 12 V-ups, and then 15 handstand push-ups. Those can be strict or kipping, it just depends on what you want. Um, now, again, this is a 20 minute AMRAP, so once you get done with your 15 handstand push-up, you're gonna go back to the top and you're just gonna repeat that for 20 minutes. As far as the V-ups go, um, if you can't do a V-up, you're gonna do a knee tuck. So what that'll look like is, come down to the ground, You'll start here with your feet up off the ground, kind of hug yourself here, and then come back. All right, um, then for the handstand push-ups, you have a couple different options here. So you have a pipe push-up. Now what that's gonna look like here, is start off in a push-up plank position. You're gonna walk your toes in to your hands as far as you possibly can, bringing your head all the way down to the ground, and then pressing yourself back to a locked out position. Uh, if you can't do that, then you can do a dumbbell Z press. So what that's going to look like, grab yourself a set of dumbbells. Sit down on the floor with your legs spread out as far as you possibly can. And with an upright torso, you're going to press up over your head and back down. If you only have one dumbbell, you can go here and you'll just do um, alternating reps. All right, and then for your rig work today, we have a little bit of a shoulder burner. So what we're gonna do is we have 15 reps of a front raise. So if you have a dumbbell, you can do this with a plate as well. You'll hold the heads of the dumbbell here, contract the shoulders back and down, bring the dumbbell to eye level and back down. You'll do that 15 times, then immediately going into a dumbbell row. So bend over here, contract the shoulder again, pull all the way back, squeeze, slow on the way down, 15 reps on one side, and then 15 on the other. Immediately going into an overhead hold for 30 seconds. So take the head of the dumbbell, hold it up overhead. And you'll have four rounds of that. 